The Mystery of Ivory Keys Hello everyone, today, we're going to explore the fascinating phrase, Ivory Keys. You might have come across it in literature, music, or even in everyday conversations. Let's dive into its meaning and origin. Ivory refers to the hard, white material that comes from the tusks of elephants and other animals like walruses. It's been valued for its beauty and used in art and crafts for centuries. Keys, in this context, refers to the individual levers or buttons you press on musical instruments like pianos and keyboards. When we put these two words together, ivory keys, traditionally refers to the white keys on a piano which were once made of ivory. Nowadays, due to ethical and conservation concerns, ivory is no longer used, and synthetic materials are preferred. Beyond the literal meaning, ivory keys can hold a deeper symbolic significance. The phrase might evoke feelings of nostalgia, elegance, or a connection to a bygone era. For many, it represents the beauty and richness of music and the history of instruments. Sometimes, authors and songwriters use ivory keys, metaphorically to paint a picture of classic elegance or to express the emotional depth and tradition of music. Although real ivory is no longer used in making piano keys, the term ivory keys still lives on. It's a testament to the enduring power of language and how certain phrases can capture our imagination long after their original context has changed. Today, when someone mentions ivory keys, they're most likely referring to the white keys on a keyboard or piano, even if those keys are made of plastic or other materials. So there we have it. Ivory Keys not only takes us on a journey through the history of musical instruments but also gives us a glimpse into the poetic nature of the English language. We hope you found this exploration enlightening and that the next time you hear or read this phrase, you'll appreciate the depth of its meaning. Thanks for tuning in, and keep exploring the beautiful intricacies of the English language.